in my research, it, it's plain to me that there is an intensive effort going on today to categorize, uh, stereotype, and uh, basically identify each member of society. And they're starting with the very youngest, our school kids, uh, with these screening for so-called mental health. Just answer this question. Have you ever felt sad Well, I venture to say everyone's going to say yes. Well, you can take that. They use that then to formulate a diagnosis of uh, latent depression or perhaps even active depression, which means you need to take a pill. In about 1951, the uh, Diagnostic and Statistical Manual uh, of the American Psychiatric Association had identified about 151 uh, mental disorders. Uh, Today, it's up to 374 and still growing. And of course, every time they come out with a new mental disorder, then they come out with a new drug to counteract it. This uh, use of chemicals to alter or try to alter human behavior has just, in my opinion, gotten out of hand. These psychotropic drugs that are pushing borderline people over into madness and violence and and even stimulating otherwise normal kids into just, you know, unconscionable acts. All you have to do is look at the record. Uh, The incidence of school shootings, teen suicides, violence has just skyrocketed. This wholesale uh, drugging of an entire generation of children, uh, we're setting ourselves up for a great fall because uh, these are the people who uh, will be determining the path of our society and of our country in the future. And uh, if we turn them into drug-induced zombies, uh, we're going to really have a problem. If that's the world you want, where everybody goes around drugged up, as in Aldous Huxley's Brave New World, and, and that they march along to the same drummer as in George Orwell's 1984. If that's what you really want, then, you know, I'm all for democracy, but I just really don't think that's what we want. We must develop a public dialogue about these psychotropic drugs and their uses and their abuses. We have just simply got to uh, return to some normalcy and some sanity uh, instead of... uh, putting a whole generation of Americans on drugs.